Westridge Mall was awash with neon today for Totally Topeka. 13's Michaela Kelly is back in the studio tonight with details from the Greater Topeka Partnerships annual meeting. Yes, Victoria GTP wanted today's meeting to be more than just business, using the opportunity to celebrate one of Topeka's most underused assets, 80 style. Though it was a day dedicated to reliving the nostalgic fun of the 80s, a panel of city leaders focused their discussion on the future. Every single thing that you see the partnership do or the entities within the partnership, we really have one thing in mind, is that's to increase prosperity for the citizens of Topeka and Shawnee County in our region. The panel, comprised of Mayor Mike Padilla, Advisors Excel co-founder Cody Foster, and Partnership CEO Matt Pivarnik, discussed key development projects occurring across the capital city. Today's event displayed the West Ridge Mall, an asset they want to save before it dwindles away. Hoping to showcase to people that there, there are some great businesses here. I think even before we bought it, um, I kind of forgot about that, so I've tried to make it a point of getting out here and shopping more, and there's so many things that you can buy locally here. And Occupancy has improved from 27 to 41 percent since Advisors Excel acquired the mall this summer, and the company has plans to bring in new services in the near future create some energy around it. Like I think what, what we have planned, we're probably still six to eight months away from really having all that finalized. And um, yeah, I do think it's going to be exciting. So, you know, it's a million plus square feet here. It's in the, the heart of our retail corridor here in Topeka. So it's, it's a massive asset to the community. The 80s theme was a lighthearted way to kick off the future, headlined by pop icon Tiffany. As a singer that got her start in malls, she fully supported GTP's message. That's one thing that was all about was bringing community together. And, and I think that's the message now further with, you know, about the malls is it is a one stop place. And I hope it starts to kind of be revitalized and come back. Foster also mentioned a meeting with an architectural designer in the coming weeks to discuss remodeling. Its HQ will house over a thousand employees once it moves in. David.